In the postgame now with head coach Ed Hoddle, Del Valley 26 and Stevenson 7 is the final. Coach, you put two tough football teams together on a football field, and that's the kind of game you get. That was a really tough football game. Yeah, that's, you know, that's top 25 football. You, you know, that's, you know, that's what you get when you, when you play a team that's big and mature and physical. And, um, you know, we just didn't make enough plays today. You know, I think we left some things on the field uh, from a coaching perspective. I think, you know, there's some things we could have done, you know, to help our guys a little bit that uh, we'll talk about and, and get better and grow from. What do you think the biggest difference in the game actually was? Well, I think their front seven defensively is, is I mean, they're different. You know, that, and they're, they're the number one or number two defense in the country, and everybody that was in the building today got an opportunity to see it up close and personal. So, um, you know, they're a handful, you know, and, and you know, that they're an experienced, you know, mature physical football team for sure. And one thing just to stay on them for a second, I, I noticed they tackle. Like you catch the ball five yards past the line of scrimmage, you're not going anywhere. Sure, and, and you know, you look you know, look at their two deep and it's senior, 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 senior. You look at our two deep and it's sophomore, 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 which is a good problem in two years. Uh, you know, that physical development, that weight room, obviously in their program, the weight room's important, um, you know, and when you have those those heavy older guys that are able to you know bring people down in one on one situations you know it's certainly advantageous speaking of tough Ryan Sedgwick uh, is tough um, he was under duress pretty much all game long had to tuck it in carry it uh, three or four times just talk a little bit about his toughness today yeah, I mean he's a tough kid you know he's he's a senior and and you know he's you know he's both mentally tough, physically tough, and and you know we knew we would have our hands full today, and I, th I think our O line for the most part did a, did a really really good job today. Um, you know again, that's one of the best defenses in the country, and you know we got to see it up close and personal. Brandon Booze nine catches and a touchdown today. Yeah, outstanding. Yeah, um, you, you know you always think that somebody's gonna you know try to take Steven away, and you gotta have a you gotta have another guy and. Um, again, d doesn't surprise me, guys. A tireless worker, team captain, uh, member of the leadership council. You know, one of those guys does everything right. And then, what do you tell the team now? Is you got a big game coming up at Kings next week? Well, it's 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 learning and growing, right? You know, we, we've talked all year. Um, you know, we, we we don't talk about winning. We talk about going out and be the best football team that we can be. You know, every single day. And you know, there's lessons to learn from today. There's um, things that we can take and we can grow from, both from you know, a schematic perspective, from a program perspective. Um, and that's, I think, what's most important is, is taking what we learn from today and, and, and applying it next week. Stevenson, four and one now, two and one in the conference with head coach Ed Hoddle on GoMustangSports.tv.